Welcome back, MTP number 28. Uh, big week, big week in the news. Um, a salute to President Bush as he departs. Uh, amazing guy, amazing man. Um, so this came off of the questions from YouTube, so I don't have a name. But he asks, I had a radical prostectomy that gave me an hourglass shape at the base of the penis, and I have ED. Wanted to know if the hourglass shape will create problems for an implant. Will they have to do something to it? Will it stop after putting in the implant? So I, I can tell you that when I trained, and uh, the, we would put in a cylinder, and we would have an hourglass defect, uh, some, of the, some of my mentors would say, oh, it's going to go away. It'll improve. It improves, but not quite the way that patients would like it to improve because it's always going to be there unless you do something. So what do we do? We use a technique called the scratch technique where we disrupt this plaque from the inside out. Um, we don't have to do any ancillary uh, things like add a graft or, or uh, deglove the penis. These are things that you would rather not see on film. But uh, with this technique by where we disrupt the plaque, you come out with a symmetric cosmetic appearance that's very acceptable and very functional. So um, some people use grafting, some people use other techniques, but I can tell you that if you really wanna get rid of this hourglass defect, uh, you're gonna want to have that taken care of at the time of surgery and depending upon the armamentarium of your surgeon, you should be able to get it done, assuming you go to a dedicated implanter. So uh, I'm not sure who this was, but it's a great question, which I, I can guarantee you a lot of residents can't answer right now. So thanks again, and we will see you next week.